This is like the kind of pasta that would make an Italian person get very upset uh, because it's a lot of cheese, a lot of sauce, and uh, a chicken breast on top. What's not so... Today on Don't Panic Pantry, we are making Eliza's garbage pasta. This is the pasta that is the one that I think she actually secretly likes the most, even though it's not a thing that I would ever make. It is angel hair pasta, already not my thing, in a blended tomato sauce with a terrifying amount of mozzarella cheese, and then adding in a seared or grilled chicken breast right on top, cause protein. First things first, let's get this chicken started. Uh, I'm gonna take a chicken breast, pound it thin, Season it with oregano, lemon juice, olive oil, salt and pepper, a little bit of chili flakes, and we let that marinate while we make our sauce. We're gonna do a quick little banger of a sauce here. Three garlic cloves. Just giving these a nice good smash, throwing them right in the pan. Olive oil, enough to do our little shallow fry guy. It's also gonna help emulsify the sauce when we blend it. As long as it's fully submerged, we're good to go. Just to get a little bit of color on this guy right here. Do this for like a good 60 seconds. Let's take a nice branch of basil right here. Throw that right in. A little pinch of the old chili flakes. A little bit of salt. Use your basil to stir it. And then we're just gonna dump this can of maters right in. A little bit more salt. A little bit of black pepper. Drop it down to a nice low simmer. And then uh, that's it. Been simmering away for about 20 of minutes, and now we can give it an old blend job. Isn't that pretty? But first, remove your basil. Everyone's favorite sound is back. Let's go grill some chicken. You could also throw it in like a hot pan, get that crispy, crispy brown edges of all your chicken, which is delicious. But I'm gonna be honest, I happen to have a gas grill and I don't really feel like uh, cleaning up another pan. Yes. One beer in the fridge. This is getting to be that time of the day, Ben. So here we have some beautiful smoked mozzarella from De Stefano cheese made right here in the greater Los Angeles area. So you do a nice little great job here. You wanna make it so that if you put your fork in the dishwasher after you ate this, that your fork will have hardened cheese on it forever. Q Ben saying, what does this do? And then eating a handful of cheese. What does this do? All right, it's go time. Here we go. Seasoning our pasta water. This is a real quick cook on this old capellini. Little angel hair. It's a thin hair of an angel. See, it's like a two minute boil or something like that. Two, three minutes. We're gonna finish it in the sauce. You're probably thinking that's way too much sauce for that amount of pasta. But I got news for you, kiddos. A little fresh basil right in there. Welcome to a land called garbage. See how it doesn't seem like that much sauce anymore? All of a sudden, it just f***ing eats it, man. A little secret weapon version of this today. I'm using the uh, Eliza uh, ice cream sprinkles method where you put a little bit of cheese on the bottom of the bowl as well to get a protective layer of extra melty bottom. That's such a huge bowl of pasta. Is that just for one person? This is just for you. When I started dating Noah, he was like, I'll make you anything you want. And I was just like, okay, you love pasta so much. I'll eat some pasta. So I asked for angel hair pasta with Parmesan and smoked mozzarella came later. He was like, great, I'll make you a bowl of pasta. And I was like, with chicken. He was like, you want spaghetti with chicken? And I was like, yeah, like you're supposed to have protein with every meal. And he made it for me and didn't tell me until way later that that's like a trash move. But in the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex where I'm from and we would go out to eat, it would be like, yeah, and like add a protein to your pasta. So you'd add a chicken. And I didn't know it was, it was suburb trash. Add chicken. Add chicken. And so now I never eat chicken with it because it's like too much food. And I don't even want it now. This looks terrible. All right, here I go. We had... Freshly smoked De Stefano mozzarella. Is that what you had shipped Delivered, in? yeah, yeah. It's so nice. And it's an organic, cage-free chicken. I don't care if it's in a cage. Mm. 
No. What's not to like about that? Take that bite. Take it's it so face. hot. That's what you want. That's how you know the cheese is good when there are no tines on your fork. It's probably pretty tasty. Well, we did it. We made Eliza's favorite garbage pasta. So garbage, in fact, that Tian Fu can't stop working. We're pretty good, actually. Welcome to Open Panic Pantry, where the mozzarella begins <laughs> and the capellini and I don't From know. our family to yours, where capellini and mozzarella meet.